recording on how to edit the theme footer. So you're going to go to your storefront um, because you do have to go to the storefront to check the, um, to make any changes to web pages, blogs, go to edit theme files. And when you're in the edit theme files, this is technically code. The benefit is for something like changing the footer, um, if you are doing this to just change some sort of uh, hours or some sort of text that's already in there, you can actually change the text as long as you stay within the P's um, because these are paragraph blocks or as long as you stay within current code, unless you know to HTML or you wanna look up, um, there are some HTML editors you can add right into your browser if you're using Chrome and they'll actually convert any languages for you that you want. So um, that's also helpful. I can throw that up in the next video. Um, <clears throat> for this, we're gonna go to the, um, the base HTML in the layout um, and you can actually do a control search for footer which is where you will start to see um, if you scroll down the page uh, where else there is a footer or a piece of the footer um, in this if you see right here so like if we knew that we we're opening the front end and we're trying to search for open right we can go right down here and we can see it says open Tuesday through Sunday 12 to 5 p.m. We can just change those times, make that Monday or any other day. So that's the easiest way to make changes to the footer, um, depending on how complicated or what you're trying to look for. Um, it might be a link to a page in BigCommerce, um, and this is short code for having that link. You can also stick in the direct HTML, um, and there's a reference here for how to stick that and connect it right to like a map or a, another page. So this could just have um, this href um, parentheses and then the full URL for our story. If we're trying to connect to the our story page or any of these other pages, we could do the same thing. So let me know if you have any other questions, comment, uh, leave them in the comments below. And thank you so much.